Hi guys, this is Foreign Frisian, and today in my list of favorite apps, I'm going to talk to you about Tasker. I can actually say that Tasker is my number one favorite app, and I was planning on making this video for a long time. This is because Tasker enables you to let your phone do things automatically for you. If you are a person who likes customization and automation, this is definitely an app for you. It's a paid application, but believe me, it's worth every cent. Okay, now let's get into it and I'll show you why it's such an awesome app. I'm only going to talk to you about the main function of the app, and that is automation. This automation works in two steps, profiles and tasks. Tasks can be as simple as put the phone in silent mode, turn on Bluetooth, or vibrate for a specific amount of seconds. Whatever you can think your phone can do, that can be a task. And with profiles, you can decide what condition should trigger one or more of those tasks. That's it. Seems simple maybe, but this enables the phone to do anything automatically for you. An example of a profile I made is rotation with videos. I hate it when my phone rotates on accident, so I always have my screen rotation set to off. But this means I have to turn it manually on whenever I want to watch a video on my phone. Well, not now, I have written this profile and tasker. The profile gives the condition, that is, opening YouTube or any other video app. And the task is turn the screen rotation on. This means that my screen rotation is only on when one of these apps are used. Now you got an idea of what the profiles and the tasks mean, and now I can show you some of the profiles I made. First, Bluetooth when no Wi-Fi. I only use Bluetooth in my car for the hands-free function of my auto radio. So I wrote a profile that says, whenever I'm not connected to a Wi-Fi, turn the Bluetooth on. This way, the Bluetooth is off when I don't need it, and it's always on whenever I'm driving in my car. This saves energy when it's off, and I don't need to turn it manually on myself. Second, short vibration by call. I made this one for more feedback whenever I make a phone call or receive a phone call. So the profile is simple. Whenever there is an in or outgoing call, the phone will give a short vibration. Let's see, 161 milliseconds, I believe. This is useful for me. But the possibilities are endless, so you can write your own profiles which you think are useful for you. I'm just giving you some inspiration of automation. Next one, maps and car. I use my phone for navigation in my car. Um, it's in a phone holder attached to a windshield. So whenever I open Google Maps, it's useful for me that the settings of the phone are turned on screen rotate and silent mode off. The next profile is one of my favorites. I call it charging at night quietly. This profile has two conditions. Only if both conditions are met, the task will be executed. The task is put the phone on silent mode. The conditions are that the phone has to have the charger cable plugged in and the time needs to be between half past 10 in the evening and nine o'clock in the morning. I made this profile so I never have to put my phone on silent when I go to sleep. This is because at night I always charge my phone, so technically the charging triggers the silent mode for me. Next one is volume hard. When one of my chosen apps are open, like uh, Google Maps, the media volume is set to level 15. That's the highest level. Uh, this way I never have to manually put the volume higher on these apps. Uh, next one I called battery saver. This one will change the screen brightness whenever my battery is low. Next one is GPS on. With certain apps you want to have your GPS on, but you don't want a GPS constantly on because it will drain your battery very much. So with this profile, whenever I open Google Maps or another app that I want to use GPS with, the GPS will automatically turn on for me. And of course when I exit the app, the GPS will turn off again automatically. Finally, I have two profiles for security reason, and the funny part about these profiles is that the tasks are triggered by certain words in received SMS. 
in a different tab I have a few profiles that put the phone on silent whenever I'm at a certain location like when I'm at the office or when I'm at my parents-in-law the phone will automatically go quiet so no ringing at the dining table if you want more inspiration for profiles there's also a section that gives some examples and of course on YouTube there is much more inspiration and guides for Tasker to be found so did you get excited to download Tasker as well or do you already have Tasker in that case I'm really curious about your favorite profile please write down in the comments what your favorite profile looks like so that was pretty much it be sure to check out the description below for more info about the app and check out my other app talk videos. I see you guys in the next one. Ciao!